AKP Member of Parliament Nisrin Ulama is rallying the party faithful. The Islamist-rooted party needs to score heavily in secular bastions like Izmir if it's to achieve its goals. Ulama is confident AKP has a broad appealing message. We are initiating a period with giant projects aimed at our people, but which at the same time will keep us in competition with the world. A decade of economic prosperity has been key to AKP's success and broad appeal, even in some opposition strongholds. But the economy is now slowing, and in areas that traditionally offered AKP strong support, there are complaints. AKP is also running its first election without its charismatic leader, Recep Tayyip Erdogan, who is now president. Prime Minister Ahmed Davutoglu lacks Mr Erdogan's popularity, says sociologist Fethil Dumas. Recep Tayyip Erdogan was a very strong leader and right now we saw that Davutoglu is still doing lots of mistakes. For that reason, voters still confused about the, who is the leader of the AKP. The AKP party has revved up its strong political machine in hopes of reducing voter confusion. This is the biggest secret behind the AK party, which resulted in its 14 years in power and success in nine consecutive elections. Our party has about 4 million female members, and behind all our political success lies the house visits of our women's branches and women members. Ulama is using this strategy to the fullest. These visits are great. We can talk about problems face to face. Izmir is a staunchly secular city whose voters fear the growing conservatism of the current government. So the ruling party is pressing hard to make inroads here, using its grassroots canvassing in the living rooms of the electorate. Dorian Jones, VOA News, Izmir, Turkey.